What's happening YouTube Squid Tech Tricks back in another video and today we're looking at the P400 Short Throw Mini Projector by AAXA Technologies. Here we go. First things first, make sure to hit that subscribe button below. Hit the notification bell so you can be notified of next videos, come up tips and tricks and unboxing just like this one. Check out my merch below at 1130.ca. Hit the like button as well so we can beat that YouTube algorithm. Without further ado, let's go ahead and show you what this thing can do. Basically, this is a short throw mini projector that you could bring anywhere with you because she could see even the box is pretty small. Let's see how well the projector does even with a small size. Here we go. It says here that it is good for native resolution is 1080p. Uh, brightness has an LED source as well and a two hour battery life. It also has a 0.7 to one short throw projection. For projectors, of course, the bulb is the key here. And because it's LED, it'll be able to do 30,000 hours of LED life, but it's only good for 400 LED lumens. So we're gonna test it out today and see how well it does. Got some literature right here. Comes with a tripod, little stand there. Power adapter right here. Remote as well. And as you can see, compared to my hand, it's pretty small. <laughs> Not bad at all. This is the front of the P400. It has the front firing speakers as well, as you can see here. And the bottom has a tripod mount as well. On the side, it has a few ports here. There's the on and off button here, the port that where you could charge it an aux in slot. There's the HDMI slot as well, and the focus ring. There's speaker grills as well on both sides, and this one has the USB. And the back has the IR blaster and the micro SD slot. The top has the touch capacitive controls as well, so you don't really need a remote, but it does come with a remote. Now let's test out the speakers. Right now it's in 50%. I'm slowly increasing it to Now let's test it out now that it, all the lights are turned off. As you can see, the photo is pretty good, especially when the lights are off. Um, the projectors are usually like that. You need to turn off the lights before um, you can use it on its full potential. Uh, during daylight, as you seen earlier, it's a little bit washed out, but it's still usable. Now let's play some games, let's play some Warzone. I was a bit worried in the beginning because I know projectors are, are, are slow on the latency, but this actually uh, is not that bad. Um, it's definitely usable. Um, I would recommend it if you are, you know, not too intense on the gaming, but you want a big screen. Um, the latency is pretty much one-to-one. -one. There's no uh, noticeable lag at all on the controls. That is really good. I said this would be great if there's a party at your house and you want to play multiplayers um, on a Nintendo Switch or something like that. Now let me know in the comments below how well it does. Um, like I said, it's a small projector. It's also battery powered. And I would recommend it if you want a portable short throw projector. Uh, definitely a must buy uh, by P400. You need to connect something on the HDMI because it doesn't have a built-in mirroring or anything like that. It's just a, a pretty basic on the software there. 
And that's it for the day everyone, thanks for watching. I hope I was able to help you on your choice on a brand new mini projector with LED lamp that is good for 30,000 hours. This one is from AAXA Technologies. If you want to get one of these, I'll link this down below, so go ahead and check that out. Make sure to subscribe to my channel, hit that like button as well so we can beat that YouTube algorithm. I hope you guys have a good day and stay grateful. Peace.